going to tell you a little bit about different types of printers. Yes, the, um, the first type of printer that's most commonly seen is a dot matrix printer. Uh, some of you that have been around for a while might remember these. These are older, they're really noisy, and they basically work uh, by a pro they're also known as impact printers. And the reason they're called that is because they actually strike the paper with pins that have ink on the end of them. And that's why oftentimes the, uh, that's why all the letters look like they're basically uh, composed of a bunch of tiny, tiny dots. Um, then you also have inkjet printers, also known as bubble jet printers. Uh, the two technologies, depending on who you ask, are slightly different, but they effectively do the same thing. They use ink and spray it onto a piece of paper. You've got your basic inkjet, monochrome inkjet printers, which are very inexpensive. Um, and you can also get the kind, basic color printers, which uh, have one black cartridge and one color cartridge. Uh, then there are mid, you know, you've got your mid-range color, color inkjets that have uh, magenta, cyan, black, and yellow cartridges. All the way up to your high-end photo printers, where you have up to 10 different colors plus black. And uh, you, can also, you also have matte and glossy print options as well. Um, so those can vary quite a bit. The third most commonly seen type of printer is a laser printer. Uh, you can get those in both monochrome, you know, monochrome black and white and in color varieties. Uh, the color laser printers are very effective and very highly detailed. The big disadvantage with those is that they're very expensive. You can usually get a really nice bubble jet for a fraction of the cost of a color laser printer. Uh, there are other types of printers out there, plotters, um, ribbon you know, there are printers that use ribbons. Uh, thermal printers. They're not very commonly used. These are usually very, very sophisticated, narrow usage, or they're flat out obsolete. 